fellow Westland people. Yes. And Ryoku, the West Michigan Bail, that does anytime he comes to the Smash Field, he he does wanna, pretty darn well. Point something out. Let's um, point something. Let's point at something. What will we so point now? Ryoku, uh -huh. when he went for paper, you okay. know, body Diani, uh, JV JV two. In yeah yeah JV yeah, two yeah yeah. 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 Uh, he had an open hand like this, like uh -huh. he's about to, he was just grabbing that rock. So really, he wasn't paper. Um, what was he? He was a crane. He was a crane. Right. He picked Wait, that rock up. Out. Okay. Hear me out. I'm listening. All right. So like, if the Mo Paper Mario World can uh -huh. have uh, machines, right? It's a it's a crane from Paper Mario World, right? This okay. doesn't mean anything. Yeah. I don't know why I'm saying this. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little confused but, as well. Uh, but we're committed. We're, we're committed. committed. Uh, but yeah. I don't know. But just just like uh, Ryo could definitely commit to those combos. Yeah. Uh, definitely go for some Bayo bread and butter day one stuff. Just side beam back and forth. Um, the one thing I worry about a little bit with this matchup for Yanni. It, okay, so both of them I think have relative uh, like matchup inexperience. Uh, I would say Yanni's played a few Bayos. A few Bayos, but it's beaten them. Yeah, it's it's been relatively close, but I can't remember him actually beating a Bayo. But who? What Bowser Jr. has really played consistently? I know he's probably played uh, the Bows before. Well, like, how often is he really That's playing? not often. So this is this, uh, definitely going to be a little inexperienced from both of them to some extent. I do believe that Ryoku has a little less oh. experience with this character, but... I don't I don't think that was a smart cart, because if you saw him get hit by the ground at side B, uh, he just kind of, like, floated right into it. But Ryoku didn't get anything off of it. So this is the issue. Okay, so Yanni loves coming to Lilac. The other issue is Ryoku loves coming to Lilat because Ryoku can bullet camp so, so well on this stage. Oh, yeah. Bayo in general, and it, it's a really good stage for Bayo. Yanni, I thought you had to SDI. Oh, Come on. Dying, well, I mean, with the uh, reduced damage. Comes yeah, reduced that's actually contact. really true. I never really thought about that. The reduced damage from the card allowing those combos to the string knockback. I mean, yeah, that's why a lot of grab confirms work super, uh, super long on. Uh, Bowser Jr. Ladies and gentlemen, that was a ram and ham. Yeah, um, ram and ham. Ya game Yanni the ram, game the ham. He did not ham have ham. that forever. And he's like, you know what? I probably should learn a few things about my character. <laughs> Especially my kill confirms. And now he's actually pretty good at it. Confirms a lot of kills with it. Because he used to be really smash heavy. Oh, and he, oh the juggles. Oh, I, I feel like he should have gone for another up air. I wonder if he could have kept juggling him. Because he reset, uh, looked like twice off of it. But Yanni with a pretty decent advantage right now, but uh-oh, Ryoku looking for the strings that we know from Bayonetta. Yeah, Ryoku, a lover of that up beat. Yes. How could you not be? I mean, yeah, it's a frame four move. Ridiculous oh, no. hitbox. I'm uh, sorry, I'm not biased. Kill can kill super, super early if you get the right hitbox and off the right combo. Oh, this is a lot of great pressure. I thought Oh, and hitting himself with the... Uh, uh, Koopa. What I really would love to see from Yanni there was drop the card on him because he was kind of stuck there with the Koopa next to him as well as the uh, the card explosion. Would have been so much damage on shield. Oh, and he oh, died. Oh, and he got the I, kill. All right, there was 60% of me was like, all right, he's about to die here because yeah. he flew really fast. Yes. And you can tell when you get hit by Bowser Jr.'s hammer, you fly like super fast and there's no red lightning. Yeah. That probably means they DI'd it poorly and he's about to die. And that's exactly what happened. Like, I, genuine, like for the most part, if he DI'd it correctly, he lives there. But that was just the surprise. Yeah. Was it reverse or was it the second hit of the hammer? What was that? Uh, it was definitely like that was a weird hitbox. It wasn't like hit the start off. of it. Yeah, um, it was at, towards the end of it. Okay, I'm we'll see sure it. We'll see it right here. So yeah, he finds it. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? He just throws the card up and he's like, "Oh, it's just." The oh, wave. I guess it was the start of it. Yeah. And we're going back to Lilat. Ryoku, like I said earlier, definitely has no problems with this stage. Uh, most of the times when I see him, he is playing on the stage. Oh, and Yanni just running right into the upbeat. He gave uh, he gave Ryoku the situation. And I feel like Ryoku could have converted it a little bit more off of it. But uh, Ryoku, I still like how Ryoku plays safe. Oh, yes. With it, instead of like trying to overextend. Uh, even if you could have gotten something off of it, if you're not sure, it's better to reset. Reset and then find another way in, you know, yeah. keep getting your damage. And Ryoku, definitely not necessarily a safer bail because he has, like, he, he's very defensive to some extent until he gets that hit. And then you're taking some damage. Oh, and ca ca caught Ryoku uh, before the witch time could actually counter uh, Bowser Jr.'s fair. Or sorry, Larry. Larry, yeah, you got to be. Okay, Yanni, please don't have speed. I saw, all right, so for dramatic effect, I move my body with, my, you know, things I say. And I look back. And Yanni's gone, but he recovers. So I was super scared there. Yeah. 
Oh, the, oh, the bat's the within. Bats within. Saving him. Wow, just gonna straight up eat that Mecha Koopa, Ryoku. Like, this is one matchup that I feel doesn't do bad on Lilat against Bayonetta, though, because you do have these annoying little projectiles that run around the stage, take up a yeah. lot of space. Like and duck right underneath the uh, bullets. Exactly. Okay, yeah, you don't have a Mecha Koopa yet. You will now. Uh, back air, gonna connect, not kill Yanni right there, because Larry oh, is awfully hit heavy. Him, hit him with the cart, uh, spun out. You know, I've seen a kill. Uh, <gasps> so he Did the Mecha Koopa him. just... Yeah, yeah, you're right. You saw that right. Your eyes just saw someone die to Mecha Koopa. Okay, but Ryoku and answers right on back. Just saw Ryoku clap back with that back air. Yeah, that was that was that was a good answer, but I've never. Okay, here comes a dash attack. And, I bet. Yep, <laughs> you're right. You're right. Uh, got a fair after that. Some Oop. of uh, Yanni's uh, bread and butter there. And honestly, this just looks like oh. a lot of a lot of uh, matchup and experience from Ryoku, though. You can kind of tell he does not know how to deal with a lot of these options Yanni's throwing out at him. Oh yeah, De uh, like Yanni's even just the Mecha Koopa is a lot. Yeah, Yanni's super smart with those Mecha Koopas. Always placing them safely, uh, never in your face unless like he knows you're gonna shield. Ooh. Oh, he should have gone for the up air there. Yeah, uh, that definitely would have been a good response to the the witch time whiffing. And I do believe that's one of the reasons why Yanni likes this stage as well. All platforms are the same height. Up smash connects through each one of them. Good fake pressure with the cart. He's like, yo, I know you scared. Wait, I know you want to hold that shield. Am I going to do it now? Nah, am right. I going to do it now, though? Uh-oh, this could be actually kind of bad for Yanni. We back. I mean, I would have, I would definitely laugh if uh, Ryoku, you know, missed his conversion but killed himself like he did with the ad. Oh, yeah, that'd be so sad. Waste all his uh, utility out there. But game's basically tied up. Will Yanni take this with a quick two? Oh, Ryoku, we can see game three. All right, sir. It's under three minutes. That's definitely not a quick 2-0. Whatever. Quick 2-0 as in, like, he got a 2-0. That's quick. You're right. You're it's right. It's quicker than game three. You see? I mean, it's not 18 minutes, so that's fine. Right. Uh, I'd be, if I'm Ryoku, I'm definitely looking out for that ram in hand. That's a very scary option from Yanni. Great shield pressure. Oh, it, it'll probably shield poke next, yeah. uh, the next time he does it. As long as he keeps pressure from Ryoku's shield. The back air, though, the DI didn't look too good, but he does live. Okay, Yanni's back to stage with oh. the back air. He's oh, living. He survives. He's got that cart. And he armored through the, the bullets. I'm not sure if you saw that. Ooh. Will he die here? Nope, goes with the forward throw. Three times in a row. It looks a situation yep, where you guys could die, but that there back air launched him that time. Uh, I, I think Ryoko is starting to figure out how to play against Bowser Jr. on this stage. Yeah. And I feel like it would be a bit more effective if Yanni went to a, a different stage where he can pressure him a bit more while also not have to worry about, you know, his only option of dealing with bullets being Mecha Koopa. 100 bucks to go back. <laughs> Where's my money, boy? <laughs> uh, he doesn't like Sashville. This is bull. All right, I'm going to set my wallet on the table here. Yeah, mine's uh, already on the table, so we good. I'm going to wait for the $100 to enter that wallet. Yeah, I'll, um, just give me a few minutes, you know? All right, all right. Go uh, mug whoever money matches Yoshka. Yeah. <laughs> Shots. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, so we are here at game three. Oh. Yanni versus Ryoku. Surprisingly, Ryoku actually did overextend there. Uh, something he wasn't doing that too much uh, the last game, you know, whenever he got a conversion, and allowing Yanni to come back to stage. Oh, that's the first grab we've seen from Yanni this game. Good mix up. Oh, I like this. Okay, I like the spin out right there because if, uh, oh, if Ryoku would have held shield, the Mecha Koopa. Would have hit him twice to spin out. His shield would have been looking real low, but. Uh, it looked like Yanni just armored through uh, Bayo's side B, uh, the down angle one. And it seemed like, you know, that could have been because it hit the cart. Yeah. It looked super weird because he was able to hit Ryoku immediately. Oh, so Ryoku picked up the Mecha Koopa. Yanni comboed him. Ryoku couldn't get it out of his hands. It took extra damage off that combo because it blew up. That air dodge was so scary from Yanni to do. Ryoku with no punish, though. That's a and kill. There goes Ram and Ham. Whew. Let's go. Let's go. Took out the can ham. Yo, you biased. All right. <laughs> but it's one of my favorite. I do. Confirms and looks really good. No, it does. It, it does. It has nothing to do with the player. I mm -hmm. mean, you can pull out the facts, but facts don't really mean anything. Uh, I mean, how could you ever use facts in court? Yeah, I'm exactly. Saying. You know, I agree with you 100 times. <laughs> but Yanni, with the early lead now, um, Keeps coming back to stage with those forward airs. So good that disjoint. 
Yeah, but oh, uh, good fake out. Worst of which was time. Keeping up really good pressure, but he tried going. He was super risky with that uh, that uh, witch time. Though Yanni actually waited with his fair, even though he's been going for it a lot. And oh, I'm not sure if you know uh, if anybody knows this. Please don't. Okay. Yeah, he down throw wouldn't have killed there. Anyways. Yeah. So he should have just kept the eyeing. Yeah. Okay. Yanni looked at me right there, and I hope he didn't like get nervous. Now there's no reason to be nervous here. You good? Oh, yeah, okay. A little bit of damage. He has, he has a definite lead here. Oh, that back air. Yeah, 107%. Ryoku definitely on the fence right now, but this is Bayonetta. Can't get too hot of ourselves. Full game's actually over. Oh, but good, good punish. punish. Yeah, really good punish on the bats with Dead. Oh, he faked that out for a while. Ryoku got a little. And the back there we air. go. There we go. Uh, I was actually afraid that uh, Bayo could have just like pulled out some combo and then boom. Would have killed uh, Yanni. Yanni. If he would have gotten a little bit more percent on him, like maybe at 30, 